Uh, we're starting off with one of my favorites. Um, any potted meat will do. I always a uh, fan of the Spam myself. I go right to Spam. It's real easy. You just open it right up. Look at that. It's already formed in, in sort of a, a block shape. And you just got to put it out of that box now. Look at that. Glorious. You could eat it just like that. But what we're doing, it, since it's a theme, a thematic sort of thing, what you want to do is you grab a big hunk of it like this. And it feels good in your hands. It's real gooey. Um, and just form it into a ball. Form it into a ball just like this. And you're going to get probably about uh, six or seven of them. Um, and just mold them like that into a ball. And then what you want to do is you put them each onto a, uh, a pan and you put it in the oven for about uh, 20 minutes at 300. Uh, and I have, um, as all the good chefs do, I've already made up a batch. Um, after you take them out, what you want to do is take some of these um, pretzel sticks that you might have lying around. Again, any it doesn't matter what brand pretzel sticks. And you stick them into the, um, the cooked ones to make it, make it look like a, it's sort of hot, make it look like the coronavirus. I call these my spam dimmicks. A lot of you like to make some fun cocktails for the themed, your themed lockdown party. Um, what I like to do is take uh, one part gin, or, or vodka will, will work too, one part gin, just pour it right into a, to a, a nice aperitif, some sort of a, a martini glass would work better. And uh, again, some of the food stuffs you may have at your house just laying around. Uh, pickles. I'm sure you've been gnawing on a jar of pickles for a while. Uh, and see, we're almost done with this one. It only took us like a week to get rid of those. Um, just pour some of that pickle juice in here. And then you've got yourself uh, a delicious theme cocktails. Uh, now I call this one a quarantini. Mm-mm. It's great. Uh, and finally, the last um, recipe uh, on the list. Now, this is a real easy recipe. Really, only there's only one ingredient. Um, it's a little whiskey. Delicious. I call this recipe depression. 